Hi, everybody. It's Miss Stone with your learning adventure for today. We're going to talk about rhyming words. We've done this a couple of times already. If you guys remember, rhyming words sound the same at the end of the word, not at the beginning, the end. So if we did a word like wall, ball, you see how they sound the same at the end when Miss Stone makes an arch with her hand? So that's what we're going to do today to sort out some of our rhyming words. And as you see, there's little pictures on my pots here. And then I have these little flowers with pictures on them that have that match for the rhyming words. Okay, you guys ready? Let's look at the words we have in the pot so far. We have this, that is a fin, a fin on a fish. And then we have this girl here, she's wet. We have the numeral 10, and we have a hut, which is a type of home that people can live in or vacation in. Okay, you guys ready? Let's do this. Our first picture is of a... Now, I know some of you guys are like, hey, that's a plane. Another word for a plane is jet. Okay, so let's say that word. Jet. Jet. Hmm. I'm gonna, what do you guys think? Which word would that go in? Let's see, let's try it with fin. Fin, jet. Does that rhyme? No. How about wet? Hmm, wet, jet. Yes, those words rhyme. So I'm gonna put that right here. Look at that pretty little flower. <clears throat> this is a bin, a bin. That you put things in. <laughs> in and in, those words rhyme, and I didn't even realize it. Let's think. We what's that? Yeah, you're right. <clears throat> Thin bin. Those words do rhyme. Look at you guys, you're so smart. All right. What about this one? What's he doing there? He's very happy because he's a winner. He won. See, he's got the number one on there. He will, he is winning. Win. Win. Yes. Yes, you're right. Win, fin, and bin, they all rhyme. Win, fin, bin. Look at that. So there's only going to be two pictures to each pot. So this one's done. So now when we do the rest of our rhyming words, we have to figure out if they go in one of these three. I have this. And yes, that is, does look like a chicken. Another word for chicken is hen. Hen. Hmm. Is that gonna go with wet, ten, or hut? Wet, hen. Ten, hen. Yes, they sound the same when we make our arch. Good job. Yes, see yeah, that? That's a net. That looks like a butterfly net. Have you guys ever caught butterflies before? They should be coming out of their cocoon soon. That's so exciting. All right, let's see where we're going to put our net. Net. Let's try this first. She's wet. You think so? Let's figure it out. Wet net. Yes, those words do rhyme. All right. So now this pot is done. So the last pictures we have are going to go for these two. Let's see. What is that a picture of? Men. They are men. Men. Let's try this one first. Ten. Yes, those do rhyme. Men. 10. Which means our last two pictures are going to go with the word hut. But let's do it anyway. Hut. What's that happening there? Yeah, it's a cut. Cut. Hut. Those words rhyme. And we have a nut. Nut. Hut. Those words rhyme because they sound the same when we make our arch. 
Good job, my friends. Let's go over the rhyming words. Ready? Win, bin, fin, net, jet, wet, men, hen, ten, and nut, cut, hut. Look at all those rhyming words that we were able to do. You guys are so smart and I am so proud of you. <clears throat> and Miss Stone's allergies are starting to act up. <laughs> I want you guys to stay happy, healthy, and safe. And I want us to help the rest of our friends around the world watch these videos so they can learn and be as smart as you guys. So if you hit the like and subscribe button, more of our friends will see it and then they could be smart just like you. I love you guys so much and I miss you. And I will see you soon.